Hey, welcome to Women Got Game. I'm your host, Sophia Fisher, and this is a compelling podcast series that explores the remarkable journey of women in sports within Northwest Ohio and beyond. Women Got Game aims to illuminate the progress of female athletes, coaches, and sports enthusiasts with a domain frequently overlooked in the broader sports narrative. In the dynamic world of sports, women are not just participants. They're trailblazers, breaking through barriers and redefining what it means to be engaged in the sports world. Women Got Game will explore the incredible journey of women in sports, highlighting their achievements, resilience, and the positive impact that they have on the sporting landscape. This podcast will also take a look at the persistent lack of sponsorships and endorsements for women's sports. It remains a glaring issue in the realm of athletics. Despite the remarkable achievements and skill displayed by female athletes, they often face a significant disparity in financial support compared to their male counterparts. This imbalance not only hampers the growth and visibility of women's sports, but it also perpetuates gender inequality in the sporting world. In this podcast, brands and sponsors have a crucial role to learn and listen so that we can play in challenging these stereotypes and investing in the immense talent and potential of women in sports. Addressing these complicated issues requires a collective effort from sports organizations, sponsors, media outlets, and fans to actively promote and support women's sports. But by fostering equal opportunities and recognition, we can create a more inclusive and equitable landscape that empowers female athletes and inspires the next generation of sporting talent, regardless of gender. It's also important to celebrate legendary athletes who shattered records and emerging talents who are making waves. The narrative will unfold, emphasizing the diversity of sports and the women who excel in them. It's not just about winning games. It's about inspiring a generation and creating a more inclusive and equitable playing field. This podcast is not going to let us forget the women who paved the way for all the women in sports today. From your physical education instructor in junior high, or the coaches who teach us about life along the way, and of course the athletes that put in the blood, sweat, and tears to win championships. That's what this is all about. And we can't forget the fans that paint their faces and love us if we win or lose, because after all, they are the fiber of our community. Gripping stories and compelling statistics will delve into the challenges women face in the sports industry, whether it be unequal pay, limited opportunities, Title IX challenges, or stereotypes. Amidst all these obstacles, women continue to rise, proving that strength, skill, and determination know no limits. Women Got Game also celebrates the strides made towards inclusivity, recognizing the importance of diversity and shaping the future of sports. It's not only about gender diversity, but also acknowledging the achievements of athletes from various backgrounds, ethnicities, cultures, and the various sports they are connected to. We'll explore a wide range of diverse sports and the business of sport itself. We'll be hearing from coaches, women rugby players, female officials, women who will position in sports administration, female golfers, professional female football players, and soccer elites, and much, much more. My hope is to talk about the challenges and also find solutions to move women's sports to close the gaps in regards to equity in all facets of sport. This podcast is also going to take a look at the underrepresentation of women in sports sponsorships and endorsements in a multifaceted problem rooted in social biases, historical norms, and misconceptions about the marketability of female athletes. Brands and sponsors have a crucial role to play in challenging these stereotypes and investing in the immense talent and potential of women in sports. Addressing this issue requires a collective effort from sports organizations, sponsors, media outlets, and fans to actively promote and support women's sports. By fostering equal opportunities and recognition, we can create a more inclusive and equitable landscape that empowers female athletes and inspires the next generation of sporting talent, regardless of gender. And we'll navigate through the inspiring narratives of women in sports. This podcast encourages listeners to embrace the transformative power of diversity, fostering an environment where every athlete, regardless of gender or background, can thrive. Women Got Game is a tribute to the resilience of women in sports and a call to action for a more equal athletic world that reflects her story and history and what will come next for the future of women in sports. 
But hey, don't take my word for it. Here's Wendy Huntley, Esquire, President and CEO of Connecting Kids to Meals. What do you think, Wendy? Women are extraordinary. Smart, we're caring, we're intuitive, we're hard workers. We just seem to be able to do it all. We, we just seem to be able to juggle a lot of things. And so, you know, when I think that women that are successful, it's because there are so many skills at work in a positive way that drive us to success. Hey, what about you, Bruce Kradgowski, former NFL quarterback? What do you say? Women just have a fire within. It's not always about the physical tools, it's about a mentality. And all the women in my life, from my mom, to my wife, to my sisters, my daughter, they're strong, confident, and organized. And let's hear from Casey Dial, amateur female boxer, ranked seventh in the nation at 132 pounds soaking wet and an aspiring Olympian. What do you think? So I think it is because I've had the opportunity to uh, kind of witness it my whole life. I've played sports from the junior pro, like t-ball level, all the way to, as of late, on a national level. And uh, I've just got to see it my whole life. There's been people working hard on every level. And uh, I guess that's why I think so, because I believe it. I've got to witness it. Vinny Scarvoni, Automotive General Manager and Women's Sports Sponsor. What do you think? If you, if you take pure strength out of any equation when it comes to sports and you look at women's sports, whether it's basketball, whether it's volleyball, no matter, even wrestling in this day and age, the technique is far superior over any men's sports, in my opinion. The way they approach any type of game, whether it's sports or life or school, it's just, in my opinion, it's just far on a whole nother level. Kelly Savage, former University of Toledo women's basketball player and financial advisor in Northwest Ohio. What do you think? I think we have the innate ability to be great listeners and to be great problem solvers. And those two attributes will um, really help you in life. And the other third thing is I don't think we have a choice. Um, it's a male dominated uh, world uh, for the most part. And if you want to make it, you got to figure it out. And we do. And Obi Obadeke, celebrity fitness and nutrition expert and best-selling author. What say you? Well, I think women got game is they have to work three or four times as hard compared to a guy. Women have been impressed for such a long period of time with before Title IX existed. They have so much motivation to succeed because women, they're what, you know, women's sports have been uh, oppressed for such a long period of time. They have every incentive and motivation to try to succeed because of how women's sports have been oppressed for such a long period of time. So that's why I believe they have games. They, they have to work three or four times as hard. And when you're put in a position when you have to think outside the box, you have to go above and beyond to get the same spotlight compared to a guy, you end up figuring out different innovative ways to be successful. By telling these stories, Women Got Game provides a platform for female trailblazers to share their experiences, challenges, and triumphs, ultimately inspiring future generations of athletes. Listeners will hear from women who broke barriers and continue to amaze us through dedication, discipline, and achievement. Women contribute to the popularity and growth of their respective sports every day. So whether you're a passionate fan, athlete, industry professional, advocate, corporate sponsor of the sports enthusiast. We welcome you to listen in and be a part of women in sports as it continues to evolve with increasing opportunities to celebrate women's achievements and contributions in sports. So the question remains, do you have game? I hope you'll join me to explore, celebrate, and be inspired to join the movement. Women got game. Join me next time where we're going to explore the issue of Title IX. I want to give special thanks to my executive producer, Chris Pfeiffer. I'm your host and producer, Sophia Fisher. Feel free to visit us at wgte.org slash women got game. WGTE. Voices around us. WGTE is supported in part by the American Rescue Plan Act funds allocated by the City of Toledo and the Lucas County Commissioners and administered by the Arts Commission.